Valley Institute of Science and Technology. But for this very moment, I stand here to represent the Institute because this is an institute that is very well known in this region, the largest of its kind, not only in this region, but also in the country. I want us to write one statement, which is a statement I would want you to carry as you leave this um, training or this camp. My grade, this right, my grade is my bargaining chip. My grade is my bargaining chip. But it does not determine my future. Effort, determination, and self-drive does. My effort, determination, and self-drive does. Are we done? So you are saying, my grade does not determine my but my grade is my bargaining chief. But it does not determine my future. My efforts, determination, and self-drive does. Underline the word effort, determination, self-drive. Focus on the goal. That is your goal. When you're making career choice, when you're developing yourself, that is the goal. I want to tell you here, choosing a career is like choosing a life partner. Do you call me? Choosing a career is like choosing? Why do you think that is so? Because once you become a teacher, I'm a teacher, you work with that career from beginning to end, isn't it? Of course, some people will change careers along the way. But do you think it's easy? Is it easy? Just the way it's not easy to change a marriage, a, a, a partner in marriage, it is also not easy to change a career. Once you become, well, once you choose your career now, study for the next three, four years, you end up in the next stage of life. Now, no, 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 so what does that mean? You have to make a very wise choice. You have to make a very wise choice. Remember that choosing a career is like choosing and that is why we are here today. And that is the essence of talking about Tibet, of talking about the university, of talking about you and career choice. So I want to briefly tell you about Agnes, as you keep that thought, let me just briefly tell you the story of Agnes. Agnes is a government institution with over 8,000 students. Why are we shifting the lives of these people? What is the essence? We are instilling skills. The, the speaker who came earlier, and I'm brother, talked about skills. Children is about skills. What is a skill? That is what we do in Tibet. We expose you to a skill, we allow you to practice the skill, you do it again and again until you become perfect and go to the industry, create a job, become innovative, and join the rest of the uh, citizens in creating jobs. Now, I'm sure you don't have this pamphlet. We have this pamphlet. As we open the pamphlet, let me continue to say that we have a staff, teaching staff, of over 400 in the institutes. We have three annex campuses. Our main campus is right here. Now, you find that you have this, right? I want us to slowly look at that. We have over 100 courses in the institution. What is written there is talking about uh, 98, but we have another seven that are not written for sure. For those people who are going to do it today, the children it is up to you to evaluate yourself and if you do not know what to do, you can always approach us and we will help you to choose the, the career that suits you. Now on that brochure, we have many departments. If you see that brochure, electrical and electronics departments, 
We have hospitality to visit. There's a list of courses there. We equip you with a skill. You fine tune the skill. You become creative with your skill. You become innovative with your skill. And the skill propels you to the highest levels. There are people who have done journalism as a course. And I keep telling students, if you want to do journalism, and many people want to do journalism, look at your personality. Are you a journalist? Journalists are not made. I don't believe they are made. Journalists are born. Why? Because journalism is a personality. So, there is a lot to do with your personality when it comes to journalism. And there is a lot to do with your personality when it comes to career choice. So, evaluate who you are, what your strengths are. If you're very good in communication, there are courses for you. If you're very good in doing B3 and Kono, there are courses for you. There is something for everyone.